Hey, what's up, guys? This is Sam here with CustomPCReview.com. We're here at Pepcom right now, and uh, we're here at the AMD booth, and we're gonna kind of like walk through this whole thing. So we're here with AMD, uh, AMD representative. So uh, can you tell me your name and uh, what do you do here at AMD? Uh, Phil Hughes. Uh, I'm head of uh, worldwide product public relations. Wow, that's a uh, that that that's a serious title. Okay, why don't you tell us a little bit about what's going on at this booth? Uh, you know, it looks like you guys got a lot of laptops going on, so. Sure, we're pretty excited about what we've got going on this week here at, at CES. Um, today we actually announced, before I start into that, today we did announce uh, some new products, um, added some new APUs. Do you know what APUs are to our roadmap? I, I didn't get any press releases on okay. that. What's up with that? An APU is an accelerated processing unit that features uh, discrete level graphics and our uh, world-class CPUs. And those are doing very well. Yeah, in fact. yeah, exactly. Yeah, so right now on market today, we've got the A series. We got E series, which is more like for your uh, smaller value notebooks. A series is more mainstream, higher performing, and then we've got um, our Z series, which is for tablets. And if okay, you take yeah. a look right here, this is an example of what our Z series is running in. It's the Vizio's tablet they just announced today. Um, what's really awesome about this 1080p screen here, so you can uh, Windows 8 Touch, all that good stuff. Same here, this is one of the new uh, ultra thins that they just announced today as well. This features our A-Series APU. Same thing, 1080p screen, touch screen, lots of great visual goodness there for anybody who's really excited about a new Windows 8 notebook. And that and that's the benefit of uh, having an APU is just the fact that you guys got you know very decent integrated graphics right onto the CPU core, right? Right, right, exactly. I mean that's the reason Vizio can go out and, and, and get a 1080p notebook out fanless, uh, our tablet as well out there, you know, at a, at a decent price point. So, okay. And uh, well, what else is happening well, over here? here is, uh, this is a, a notebook from ASUS. This is a, again another Windows 8 touchscreen notebook, um, running uh, our A series APUs as well. And you can get this. So the great thing about this is you can get it with an A series APU, or you can also get um, some of the new discrete graphics that we just announced today too. We just announced a new uh, 8000M series Radeon graphics for notebooks, so you can get this configured with just an A-series APU or A-series and uh, Radeon uh, discrete graphics for dual graphics for you know some, some of your more intense gamers. And is the uh, 8000M series uh, a part of the 28 nanometer family of graphics cards? It is. Yeah, it features our GCN graphics, Graphics Core Next. Yeah. Excellent. Okay, so what's that? Here, okay. This is a notebook that HP just announced today, and if you go across there, they'll tell you even more about it. But this is their most affordable touchscreen notebook. Starts at a uh, price point of, I believe, about six forty nine U.S. So uh, again, another touchscreen Windows eight. Um, you know, you can take a look at that, feel it. It's a you know pretty pretty good note, pretty good sized notebook. Um, and again, their most affordable touch out there. Excellent. All right. So final one. Looks like we got something from MSI. Uh, Yeah, Dave can tell you about this MSI notebook, which uh, yeah is probably the most impressive gaming notebook you're going to find out there right now. Okay, all right. So uh, tell me a little bit about what you do here, uh, Dave, and uh, we'll, you know we'll talk about the MSI notebook. Okay, well I'm happy to do so. So thanks for asking about the MSI GX60. Um, MSI decided to make one of the ultimate uh, PC gaming notebooks, and so they they pulled out all the stops. This has our AMD A10 APU. It's got our AMD Radeon HD 7970 gigahertz edition graphics in it. It has the steel case keyboard on it. It has the killer NIC, so very low latency if you're playing online gaming. And it actually has gold-plated connectors on the side. I don't know if you can see that. Very solidly built. You've got a 1080p matte screen here, so you have, you have no glare on there. And drives the latest, greatest games at a really good rate. Um, if you want to play with three screens, you can actually go with AMD Infinity and set up a three-screen configuration for your gaming experience. Oh, wow. Okay. Just just from the mo notebook then? Exactly. Just from the notebook. All right. Yeah, that's uh, very cool. And uh, what, what do you have over there that, that uh, looks like a, a Sapphire? 
uh, Sapphire Mini PC right there. So why don't you talk a little about? That's a Sapphire Mini PC being driven on an APU, uh, an AMD APU. I think it's our A8 in that particular one, although you can get it in both A6 and A8 configurations. Um, beautiful little design. It's obviously got some uh, SD. It's got the SD slot on there. It's got a number of USB ports on the back. It actually has HDMI and I think VGA. I can't see it from here. Um, it's got the HDMI connector and it's got a mini uh, display port connector on the back of that as well. So beautiful design and actually ships with the Visa mount. So you can mount it on the back of your uh, TV if you'd like. So it's completely So it'd be sight. like an excellent uh, HTPC solution for, you know, those are guys who, who, who need something for, uh, you know, watching movies and, exactly. and things like that. Exactly. I couldn't have said it better myself. So good point. <laughs> excellent. Well, you know, maybe, maybe I'm going to be AMD marking from now on, right? <laughs> exactly. Okay. Uh, Last one is—is is that anything, or is that just the picture frame that That's I'm just pointing the at? Frame, telling you about this particular unit right there. So. It, it's not powered by by AMD uh, processor in there. That I don't know. Okay. Good question. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, I'm gonna give you guys a chance to plug. Why would anybody want to go with uh, AMD products? Well, there's a lot of reasons that you go with something from AMD. Obviously, the graphics experience is excellent. The power efficiency is excellent. Really well-built products as well. So a very robust experience for someone uh, wanting to make sure that they've got a device that's going to meet their needs now and in the future. Excellent. OK. Um, any social media contacts? Uh, how would they find you know, both well, you of you can, guys? You can find out about what we're doing at CES this week, hashtag AMD at CES. You can always go hashtag AMD. Uh, I'm I'm AMD Phil on Twitter, so you can track me down there. Um, anything else? Facebook, Facebook, LinkedIn. We have AMD on Facebook, so follow us there. Um, yeah. So we'll All right. How about you? Same thing here. I mean, if you want to track me down, it's uh, AMD David AMD uh, on Twitter. So happy to take any questions that anyone has via the Twitter route. Um, and obviously, I'm always watching our blog site as well. So if people want to post questions to the various blogs we're posting on our graphics, happy to get back to them on, with your questions. OK, excellent. Okay. Yeah, I want to thank you guys for uh, the interview and uh, catch you guys later. Thank you.